All right, what up, guys? Plock the Master Gamer here. We're back at it with some Fable 3. And this is, of course, the Evil Bitch playthrough where I, you know, only do the evil things, right? And in the last video, we were doing, you know, something or other. Why do I feel like I'm supposed to, like, go in here? I don't know. What, uh, what is this place? Bright. Oh, I do remember what I was doing. That's right. That's right. I fucking murdered the whole town. Um, but yeah, no, other than committing genocide in Brightwall, the, uh, the other thing that I've been doing is just doing random quests, right? Excavation. Dark Sanctum. Well, you know, let's see what that one's all about. Why not? Also, make sure you smash that like button real quick. It definitely helps me out. And also, of course, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and uh, ring the bell for notifications, all that stuff. I do actually upload content on this channel daily. I've done so for the past couple years now, so there's always some new content for you guys. And then finally, last thing, of course, uh, you can become a channel member for as little as 99 cents. So, uh, yeah, just wanted to throw that stuff out there real quick. Anyway, fuck, bro. This way? Dude, how come everybody has guns now? The undead have guns. The fucking Hobbs have guns. Literally everybody has fucking guns, bro. The Dark Sanctum. I think this is our first time here, actually. Yeah, we we never even been here before, boys. So this is the this is the Chapel of Scorm, huh? Ah, greetings, my mystery. You fucking friend. serious? Look, I don't even know if I have five thousand gold, bro. Stands the Dark Sanctum. A sanctuary for all that is cruel and horrid. I wish I would have known that I was going to need that much fucking money. Nobody fucking told me it was going to be 5,000 fucking dollars. Like the fucking quest is literally just give him money? What the fuck do you mean, bro? Am I still a wanted criminal here? Yes, I am. I buy stock How so fucking wonderful, and, uh, bro. I'll buy your I'm just over here trying to do my fucking job. You guys won't let me. Will it? I swear to God, will it let me fucking do this? I swear to fucking God, bro. Really? No, it's not going to let me? Hey, look, dude. I know, I know. We've we've had our differences. How much money do I have? Damn, that was a lot of my money. No worries. Though. I'm about to be making three thousand dollar pies here in a second, so it shouldn't take long. I know, right? We're supposed to be making money with real estate, but here I am making oh, fucking pies again. Got to make that murder money back in two pies, bro. Literally, just make two pies. It's not even a job for the community. It's literally just my own selfish fucking job. I'm like, I'll, I'll, I'll make two pies and then I can kill like three people. If you can find better prices anywhere, oh shit, did I just get paid for my real estate? Tell you what, we'll, we'll at least reach level 10 because we got to get that max multiplier. You can't just like start a job without reaching the max multiplier, right? Who's cooking these pies, by the way? I love how I'm like a master fucking pie maker, but like I don't even fucking cook them. I'm just like, I, I roll the dough, that's literally all I do. I have not put a single ingredient into this fucking pie. I literally just roll the fucking dough. And I get paid... I get paid $3,000 per fucking wad of dough that I roll. I don't even make an entire fucking pie. It's just like, oh, he rolled another flat piece of dough. Time to give him 3,360 fucking literal coins made out of solid gold. Oh, that one pie crust that you rolled out that took half a second? Yeah, that's worth over 3,000 chunks of fucking physical, actual gold. Like, what? I ain't tidy in fucking shit. Oh, you know, maybe there are ingredients in there. But I didn't put, I didn't fucking put the ingredients in there, you know? It's like, this bitch fucking hands me a bowl full of ingredients. She's like, here, flatten this wad of fucking dough and just stick it under the fucking table. Like, I'm just saying, bro, like, I must be making some pretty good fucking rolls of dough there, man. Like, I really hope it just fast travels me to the fucking sanctum now that I've been there. I really hope I don't... Oh, my fucking God, bro. Dude, this game fucking sucks so much fucking dick. Like, oh, yeah, you gotta walk fucking 10 miles anytime you want to fucking go somewhere. We just we just don't really have fast travel in this game. Sorry. Like, oh, yeah, we have fast travel, but you still have to walk for 10 fucking minutes. Like, how fucking stupid, honestly, bro. Like, just let me fast travel, bro. Like, you literally can't have, like, both. You have to choose one fucking lane. You cannot have a fucking open world, fucking completely vast fucking open world map without having fast travel. Like, if you want to have a large open world, there needs to be, like, direct instantaneous fucking travel. Otherwise, nobody's gonna want to play your fucking game. Like, could you imagine, like, literally any fucking open world game if they didn't let you fucking travel? Like, imagine playing Skyrim, but with no fast travel methods. Or, like, if you fast travel anywhere, you still have to walk halfway across the map. Like, could you imagine? Like, nobody would play Skyrim if you had to walk, like, fucking for 10 minutes anytime you wanted to go literally anywhere. Nobody would play it. 
They'd be like, what? I can't even fucking teleport somewhere close. I have to teleport somewhere that's a 10 minute walk away. Like what? Like at least in the first fables, like you could teleport like pretty much anywhere. And if you couldn't teleport there, it took you like 30 seconds to walk there from the fucking the, the ah, teleporter. Greetings, my miscreant friend. The color skate. That's what they call those things. Oh, damn. They're really getting to work, aren't they? What are they digging, by the way? They're just, that's just like a cave that's going to get unburied eventually, probably. Yeah, like this fucking pile of rocks is just going to be gone one day. And I'm just like, oh, walk through there. Oh. Ah, hello. You know you don't have to greet me every fucking time I press pause, right? Oh, okay. That sounds decent enough. Damn, this is really the fucking bridge they want to build, huh? Please allow me to introduce That's my literally name. it? Okay. My Fuck name it. Is Griffith Smith. And I'm the president of the... Alright. Come back later on once the bridge has been built. What the fuck does later on mean, bro? The real question is, was building a bridge evil enough for this playthrough? Uh, you made a big mistake Wait, what the fuck? What do you mean, bro? I'm literally in town right now. Oh, what's up, guys? What happened? What happened? You guys were fucking, like, hella tough there for a second. What happened? Are you sure you don't want to get a little bit closer to this village here? Where the guard is? Are you sure? Are you sure? Oh, here we go. Are they gonna kill this fucking guard? That's the real question. This guard is gonna fucking die 100%. No way he's gonna live. Absolutely no fucking way. Oh, he's fucking dead, bro. He didn't stand a fucking chance, bro. Oh, I remember this one. This is the one where he calls him, like, fucking ugly or something, right? It's, like, literally just a fucking letter that's talking shit. Like, it's actually fucking hilarious as fuck. Oh, you can barely afford the rent. That sucks. Uh-oh. For me, I wonder what he says. <clears throat> Dear Zachary, you are an ugly, incompetent buffoon, and nobody likes you. You're sincerely Arthur. <laughs> oh, how rude! Fucking amazing. It's like some of the shit that they like call a quest in this game is like a little bit ridiculous, but at least it's funny. And what else we got? Mercenary customs. Please don't make me put that shit back on. You fucking kidding me right now? Oh, goody. I get to grab his fucking hand, bro. That's right. This game is fucking, like, that kind of gay. All, my life. My was too. all your life, bro. You're about to fucking have a short life, I guarantee you. Stuff in one place, it in another. Hmm. It's an amazing story you have to tell there, bud. So far, there's only one sign. Keep your eyes peeled for renegades and bandits. There's always more than your bargain for. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, how perfect, right? I really hope Brightwall's up this way, man. Well, there's bandits over here. Oh, that looks like Brightwall. There's gotta be Brightwall. Either that or it's fucking Bowerstone. That was, like, way shorter of an escort than I thought it would be. I'm not gonna lie. I actually I actually do remember this quest 100%. Fucking just run into people. I love it. We've made it. Thank you. Here's wow. a little something for you. Oh, and come back later if you like when I've got my stall set up. I'll give you a good price. Not if I buy your shop and make the prices terrible. You know what? No, oh, fuck you guys. Fuck literally all you guys, bro. You guys, you guys still want to talk shit? That could have gone better. That person now hates you, but no matter. Hate has its upside. A Does it? Comes... You've got to help me. I'm so worried. It's not. It always comes back after a while, though. But... No, actually, the real question is, how many fucking enemies are gonna come while I'm trying to find my way here? Like, all I want is a mod that makes it so the gold trail never disappears. It's like, again, like, you can't have your cake and eat it too. You literally gotta pick a fucking lane, bro. Like, either give me a mini-map, 
or make the fucking golden trail be there 100% of the time. Like, you shouldn't just leave the players in the fucking dark, like, 90% of the time they're playing the game. Like, I want to know where I'm fucking going, bro. Like, even with just some little tiny amount of, like, inkling of knowing, like, I need to know what the fuck I'm doing and where I'm going, bro. Like, you can't just not let me know where I'm going. That's fucking stupid. So what I'm still wondering is, how the fuck do I get down there? Like, there's, like, a whole unreachable part of this cave system that I just still don't understand. When you go to rescue her, it's like, it's like a fucking dead end, right? Like, I guess there's this fucking chest here, but... It's like, what's the deal with that? Like, it just doesn't continue, but it does continue? Like, what? Like, does anybody know what the deal is with this place? Where are we, by the way? That's the other thing. It doesn't tell you where you are, bro. It says I'm in Miss Peak Valley, but where am I, bro? Chill Breath Caverns. Here we go. So there's three different entrances to this stupid fucking thing. That's why. That's literally the stupidest fucking thing I could have ever heard in my life. Like, do you realize how fucking stupid that is to have one cave that has three different fucking entrances needed to explore the whole thing? Like, do you realize how fucking stupid that is? Like, I don't think a single video game in history has done, done something that fucking stupid. Like, what? It's a good thing kids can't die in this game, am I right? <clears throat> then fuck off! If you can't talk to strangers, then fucking go die. I don't give a shit, you're not my kid. If you don't like talking to strangers, maybe you shouldn't get stuck in fucking caves, huh? It's like the perfect place to find a stranger. Like, you probably shouldn't be there. So I'm telling you, man, this game fucking lies to you. You don't have to fight a single fucking thing in this game. Yeah, oh, except for guards when you kill everybody. I did that quest in so much less time than I thought I would. I'm sitting there like, can I do this quest in 10 minutes? Bruh, can I do this quest in 5 minutes is the real question. Oh, this guard is fucking straight waiting on me too. I can't thank you enough. I'm forever in your debt. You want to pay off my bounty then, huh? That'd be a nice move. Uh oh. I'll tell you what, man. I wiped my fucking ass with 1260 gold anyway, so here. Consider it a fucking charitable donation, huh? Charitable donation. You're welcome, guys. Yeah, you're welcome, buddy. You're welcome, huh? I paid your fucking salary today. You're welcome. Talk shit, though. I dare I dare any of you fuckers to talk shit. I fucking dare you guys. Complain about the fucking rent. Do it. Do it. Oh. Whoa, is this something that I'm wearing? What's funny? What's fucking funny? Complain about the rent. Complain about some prices. I fucking dare you. Oh, weird. Everybody's fucking quiet. Oh, yeah, the... Never. Never. Whoa, 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 bitch, what's bad? What, what the fuck is bad, huh? Yeah, that's what I thought. That's what I fucking thought. Fuck you, buddy. Shops on now. I can't believe they only charge you $250 when you kill somebody. Yeah. Talk shit. Oh, yeah? Who the fuck is a hooligan, bitch? I can impress you with 250 gold, though, I bet. Here, talk shit, motherfucker. Talk shit. Who else has some shit to say? Oh, you're lucky you're a fucking kid, because you can't even fucking die. Oh, yeah. Keep your fucking head down, asshole. Don't say anything. Don't say anything. Okay. Fucking piece of shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know the drill. Just do it already. I'm gonna fucking hit you if you don't charge me. Fine. Come on. Bitch, do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. What's my... Here. There we go. How are you doing, sir? Good. Well, kind of sounds like this, this town finally got their fucking act together. Not hearing a fucking peep. Because he's fucking dead, right? No? Isn't he? Did little peep die? Oh, he did die. Oops. It's probably his fault, though, right? See the one that took a million Xanax and died? Is, is that the one? It's probably his fault. Overdose from Xanax and fentanyl. Yep, his fault. Fucking idiot. Stupid fucking dropout. Where'd that... Oh, look at you, buddy. Boom, bitch. Anyways, though, I think I that's probably about it for this video. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave a like. It definitely helps me out. And if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to this channel if you want to check out any more of this content or any of my other gaming content for that matter. And of course, as always, for as little as 99 cents a month, you can become a channel member, help support this channel monetarily, help me pay some bills around here, that sort of thing. Yeah, with that being said, I've been Plock the Master Gamer with some Fable 3, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.